How does DAM make sure people only see the images that they're supposed to see? Behind the scenes, there's a lot going on to make sure your files are secure. To explain how it works, let's take a walk through your local grocery store. As you walk through the store, you see familiar departments like the bakery, the butcher shop, and the deli. Each of these departments have unique products they sell and dedicated staff to work with those products. Different employees in different departments need different kinds of access to product images. So DAM uses a series of roles and permissions to simplify it. DAM looks at two big things. A role, which is a group of people that are related in some way, and an asset group, which is a group of assets that are related. Access, or permissions, are the connections between the two. It groups people together, and it groups images together, and then connects them. You can visualize this by drawing it out. For our roles, we have butcher shop, for the people that work in the butcher shop. We have deli, for the deli workers, and we have bakery, for, you guessed it, the bakery workers. Just for fun, let's add a role for the marketing department. They'll have different needs than the other groups, and we'll go over that a little later. For the asset group column, we'll create some groups where we'll put our images into. When we add images of salami and ham, we can put them into the deli asset group. We'll put images of bread and cupcakes in the bakery asset group. And finally, we'll put images of steak and chicken in the butcher asset group. Now we get to have fun connecting the dots by matching roles with asset groups. The connections in our example are pretty self-explanatory until we hit the marketing department. The marketing staff has to work with all of the images, so we'll connect them with all of the asset groups. You can have as many roles and asset groups as you need to make sure all your groups and all your images are connected or permissioned properly. As the store adds new employees, they can easily be added to the correct role and they'll get access to what they need automatically. The connections between roles and asset groups can be customized in many different ways to allow or not allow users to do things with the images like view them, download them, or edit and delete them. There are many options to make sure businesses as small as a grocery store or as large as a huge international brand can easily control who sees their images and who does not.